Hi guys, and welcome to my new video about Sam and Danny Break the World. Wakey wakey, sleepyhead. You've been snoring all morning, silly. We've already started setting up camp. Come on, Chip Dick want to see you. Now we should be following Danny. And into the professor's tent. I just love how she walks perfectly on the bath. Professor Chipstick, Sam's awake. I brought him just here just like you ask. Ah, uh, excellent. We can get started as soon as I um, piece together these strange symbols. Where are they, Professor? The reason we're here, of course. We've been exploring this lost jungle for almost two weeks now. No sign of the hidden temple. Legend says it only appears to those who are truly worthy, and these symbols are a vital clue. I'll continue to study them and while we'll both of you um, search the depths of the forest. Ugh, do we have to walk? Of course you don't have to walk. Of all the ventures we've been on, have I ever left you without my, one of my cool inventions or vehicles? It's time we get the motorcycle fueled up for a dive. Explore the campsite. One of the campers should have the keys to the motorcycle. When you're ready, see me at the end of the airport. I mean, airfield. Okay, so um, the girl who's near the clothesline should have the key, and um, we will go there, collect the key. Hey, Sam. Oh, yeah, here are the keys to the motorcycle, is what she said. And there's the um, professor right there. Um, also... I just wanted to mention this, that um, this um, Sam and Daddy Break the World is actually a free world, and um, all you have to do is download it from the marketplace, and you should be ready to go. Okay. okay. You know, um, Danny should have told us she was a... Wasn't a big fan of the motorcycle in the first place when we were talking about the motorcycle, but now it's a little bit late. <laughs> anyway, try your best to avoid going off the path because um, if you're deep enough, it might be a little hard to get back up onto the path. Anyway, this is all you have to do is stick to the path. Nothing really to know over here. It's okay to go over the branches because they don't really do anything to you. Okay, so um, now all you have to do is follow the path, and that's it. Okay. Okay, so the blue, green are blue, blue and green squares or rectangles are um, are supposed to help you go faster. I'm pretty sure. The red ones slow you down. I'm pretty sure the purple ones make you flow in the air. I'm not really sure. Anyway. Um, you also should go through a cave. Yeah, there. So, in this part of the video, it's there's nothing really um, difficult in this part. Because all you have to do really is drive. And... I just realized that Danny said if you do that again, I'll scream, but I didn't even do anything. Look out for that tree log. Tree trunk. Cool. Uh, I see, I see. This is cool. Okay, if you don't want to, um crash or anything my best advice is just to go slow and make sure you or, or if you go fast just make sure you just slow down near the curve so you can have um enough time to move oh wait what the heck just happened uh, wow great job sam you crashed the bike what i didn't even do anything i was just driving the temple. Chipstick was right. Look at this place. It's ancient. The cracks in the walls, the mold. So overgrown. It's as if it's been here forever. This is amazing. But we should be careful, Sam. Who knows what we'll find here? Spiders, that is. 
and a chest. What? What the heck? That was easy. What is this ancient ruin? Sam, this place is giving me the creeps. I see tombs and stuff. What? What if there's zombies around here? Wow, this open courtyard is so familiar. It reminds me of some of the um, other shrines we discovered on the past adventures, like a place for worship built for a specific place. I mean, reason, I guess. This room doesn't look reachable, unless you're thinking what I'm thinking. Yes, a secret puzzle. See what you can find. We have to find the ancient ruins. So, oh, and I, I've already collected one, so I'm guessing the other ones are supposed to be in chests. I mean, like, where will they else would they be? Unless they're on an item frame on the wall, which, or barrel, but then the update isn't there, so no barrels. Okay, ancient ruin, got that. Okay, let's travel among this place. What's here? Don't see much. Oh, another chest, yes. It says, oh, spider, spider, get rid of it. How do I not see that coming? It's just so small. Okay, it says find the ruins. It says, I, I think it says that there's one more ruin left. But, um... I don't think, we don't need any more ruins. All we need is three because they, um, you're supposed to put them in the item frame on the temple, in the temple. Okay. Now just place it in the order that you see here. I'm not sure if that's as necessary. I'm not sure if the order is like a certain order, but just, um, if it doesn't work, just place it the way I did. You're right, I'm probably just being over dramatic. Enter the chamber. Okay, so Danny said that this place looks creepy, I guess. And the world stuff and all. What on earth do you think you're doing? You've just destroyed the whole world. You've doomed us all. We need to leave now. So you activated a booby trap triggering the end of the world? I think it's a good time to say, I told you so! Did you even find any treasure? Uh, it disappeared. What do you mean it disappeared? Well, at least there are no living. Never mind! We can talk later. Get the skeleton! <laughs> Those skeletons look so creepy. What's wrong with their heads? They're just like so creepy. I hate these skeletons. I feel like there's something wrong. Why would skeletons be here? Eh, I mean, she said there's no living things, but technically these aren't living things. She was right. Because, how did I not hear you? Anyway, skeletons are dead, so are zombies and creepers and all the stuff. I wonder what creepers are based on. Skeletons and zombies are real, are there in real life, so. Ah! Let's get rid of it. Let's get rid of it. No, no, no. You are not getting me. Are we almost done? I'm scared. I'm scared too. What do you think? I wonder what happens if you die in this level. I'm not going to find out. Please hurry, Sam. I feel like this is the last round. Or maybe two more rounds of skeletons. Duns. Skeletons. I keep seeing five of the skeleton warriors zero, even though there's like one left, two left. Help! Escape to the lake. Okay, so what you have to do is run towards the lake and you will be safe if you run. I'm pretty sure you'll be safe even though you don't run, but it doesn't matter. Anyway, we, we, we made it! We're, we're alive! Wow! Good job back there, Sam. This day just keeps getting weirder and weirder. Okay. Whoa, what just happened? Why am I floating? Ah, why can't I move? I can't move. And what's that TNT? Okay. Visibility okay. for a thousand million, I don't know, seconds. Was that a spaceship? I'm just going to be quiet. Wait, Sam, what is that floating thing? I'm Orby, the soul that protects the temple. You just broke the master block. 
we're going to have to rebuild it because before rebuild it before it cr reality crumbles. That spaceship must have crashed through a portal. It looks like a rip between worlds. We'll have to travel through it to save Minecraft. Let's start by investigating the crash site. Jeez, what what a mess. Okay. We need power. Um, you have to power up the engines to fly through the portal. Well, it's a pretty simple if you got all the pieces. Search around the crash site if you see some of the parts. Wow, really? Awesome. Let's go, Sam. You have to find the blocks that look like the one right ahead of me and press the button in front, I'm guessing. Yeah, because it just destroyed. And I collected it. Okay. Okay. So just searching, searching. Look around. Okay. Okay. Nothing there. Nothing here. Wait. What? Where's the heck said? Can't go out. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, I think I found one. Press it. Yes. Okay. Yeah. How did it open up? Let's go inside. Okay. okay. How did they get there before me? They're before. They're down there before. Assemble the rocket. Okay. Put it in the front. Where, where did I put it? Um, okay. No, nothing. Let's see if I can place it there. Okay, it's not letting me place it there. Okay. Place some spaceships and you can see the arrows at the tail. Oh, at the tail. Okay, so I, I think we have to go down underground. I mean, back down there. Arrows, okay. Got it. Going down. Okay. 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 Yes. Hey, not too bad. Are you sure you aren't rocket scientist? He. <laughs> Hop in and let's set off. We have a world to save, guys. Though this, the thing won't still um won't power still won't power out on though on though. Hmm, let me see if I can do something about it, that. Orby, I'm not sure what you just did, but I think it's working. Power to maximum capacity. Jet fuel burning. Engine power lines illuminated. Acting thrusters. Preparing boost sequence. Do you want to do the honor, Sam? Press the button at the front of the cockpit. And you should be done. Thanks for watching, guys. Or, just thank you for playing. Ha, ha, ha. Blast off! Blast off! Sam and Danny go to space! Cool. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and can't wait to see you guys in the next episode. And just remember, this is a free world, so you don't have to pay. And all you have to do is go to the marketplace and download.